রাজ্যের বন দপ্তরের পক্ষ থেকে সোমবার এক সাংবাদিক সম্মেলনের আয়োজন করা হয় সাংবাদিক সম্মেলনে উপস্থিত ছিলেন বন দপ্তরের বিশেষ সচিব এস কে শেট্টি এবং অন্য পদাধিকারীরা রাজ্যের বন সম্পদের বৈচিত্র্য এবং অর্থকরী সম্পদ সৃষ্টিতে বন দপ্তরের বিভিন্ন প্রয়াসের কথা সাংবাদিক সম্মেলনে উল্লেখ করেন বন দপ্তরের বিশেষ সচিব বনায়ন সহ বন সম্পদ বৃদ্ধিতে বন দপ্তরের যেসব কর্মসূচি রূপায়ণ করেছে তার বিস্তারিত তথ্য জানান সচিব এই ক্ষেত্রে রাজ্যের বন দপ্তরের কাজকর্ম অন্যান্য রাজ্যের বন দপ্তরের কাছেও উৎসাহের বার্তা বহন করেছে বলে জানান বন দপ্তরের বিশেষ সচিব for the children who come to the anganwadi so they can be part of the diet and they have help us the nutrition augmenting the nutritional status for the children who come to the anganwadi centers and uh, also the other initiative taken up by the by the department as a part of the prati garaj sushasan campaign is the disbursement of loan or the revolving fund to the self help groups through the tripura jaika project and uh, up to the uh, up to the previous fortnight of this month i am happy to say that up till now about 14797 seedlings have been supplied uh, as a part of the during this campaign to about 7148 beneficiaries 151 tree registration certificates have been distributed to the people uh, who had earlier applied for these trcs and 11 other other registrations uh, other registrations for the private other plantations have also been done as a part of these campaigns then seedling this planting has been done 803 anganwadi centers so this is the last number about 803 anganwadis the forest department has ensured that five sites seedlings are planted of uh, fruit plants in each of these anganwadi centers so that in the coming years these fruits are available readily to the children who come to those anganwadi centers jaisa ki aap logo ko malum hai that makes impression with the arrow card is particular i can speak in english only so as you all know the tripura forest department is concerned with the management of uh, um, uh, forest and wildlife and biodiversity resources of the state uh, in our state the forests are basically Uh, the forest type is basically tropical evergreen semi evergreen and moist deciduous carnivorous forest we have a very high forest cover in the state while the forest area per se is only about 60% but the total forest and tree cover is about 73.64 so we take a lot of pride in that our state is a green state so we have a we have a high tree and forest cover in the state green uh, green tripura is uh, what we take pride in administratively uh, the state is divided territorial in, into five forest districts this is the unique uh, uh, administrative system that we have in the forest in our state while in other states the forest administration system is quite different it is not coterminous with the revenue administration system but in our state it is unique in the sense that the revenue administration system and the forest administration system is coterminous it's the same so the result is that we have uh, this allows us to implement a large number of schemes of the central government and the state government and also our own initiatives in a very smooth manner in convergence with the revenue administration so this is a unique advantage that we have in tripura which is not enjoyed by any other uh, state in the country and many of the other forest departments of the country have been in touch with us and they have asked us how you have do, done this kind of convergence and they are also trying to do take up similar initiatives to converge forest administration to revenue administration so this is we are the first in that sense in the country so uh, that is a unique achievement for our state uh, for the forest administration uh, 